Hello everyone, I'm so glad that you decided to join me for this video and I wanted to discuss actually a topic that I kind of took from a video I just watched on the Braveheart Women TV forum where Margaret Paul, she is a uh, award-winning author and psychologist, she mentioned something on the show and it really resonated with me. And what she was talking about is really are you trying to control those that you love or are you loving those that you love? Are you trying to control that situation or are you lovingly accepting and embracing that situation? And that's not exactly what she said but that's what I wanted to discuss in the video. So really it's funny because my whole life I've really had this need to control the situation. Really feeling like I needed to control all of the aspects of the situation in order to avoid an issue or a problem. And I was really shown on a different level this year how love as opposed to control really does make the whole situation that much better. So my parents are separated. They're still going through the divorce right now and it's been a while. So that's part of my family history and I just wanted to share that to give you the background. So up until now, uh, the last dinner that my parents were at together that I was at was my brother Sean's wedding and they haven't really been together for especially holidays like Christmas, Easter, blah blah blah. So this year I started to kind of get a little bit butterflies, a little bit nervous because we had invited the whole family over for dinner, including my mom and my dad. And up until the dinner, I was worried so much about all of the different aspects, I wanted to control all of these different aspects, I had gone back into the survival mode. And you know, I did use a lot of my tools that I learned from Elise and Restore, uh, which helped to really reduce the amount of stress. But this was a survival mechanism that I was tapping into from one of those uh, remaining uh, things in my life that I was still feeling static of, my parents being separated. And I'm sure there are many people watching this video who can understand where I'm coming from. So the thought of these two People in my life who I really love coming and being in the same household for a whole evening was a little bit stressful for me. I started to tap into adrenaline. So once the whole dinner started to happen, my mom was first to arrive, she helped me out in the kitchen, and at that time I was not exactly in the best state. I was trying to control, I wanted to get things done. And then once everybody started to come in and I realized that I could not control the situation and I just let go and enjoyed the evening, I started to realize, wow, the whole evening went by. There was no conflict. There was no issue with them being in the same house together. And that had surprised me. And it was really funny because afterwards when I looked back at the whole evening and realized I'd fallen into the same thing that I was, that I had already learned doesn't work. Controlling the situation does not work, but love and embracing what's happening, embracing the people you love and embracing the situation for whatever it is, you can generally have a pretty good time. So I ask you, are you trying to control the situation or are you lovingly accepting it? And if you're trying to control it, might I make a suggestion to you? Try to just lovingly embrace it. Actually, as Yoda says, do or do not, there is no try. Go ahead and lovingly embrace and accept the situations in your life. You'll be surprised at how much fun you can actually have when you stop trying to control what is going on around you. So may you grow, thrive, and flourish. And let's hear your comments in the section below. I really want to hear your thoughts. And I want to see you on the next video. So this has been Kat Bicker, and we will see you very soon.